In today's StaffleBond.com contributor review video, we're taking on the house of Costume National, a small Italian designer house and their fragrance, Soul. This one right here. We're going to review this, plus you'll have a chance at winning a full bottle of Soul if you are in the USA. So please stay tuned. Thanks so much for tuning in. This is Sebastian with Smelling Great Fragrance Reviews. If this is your first time on this channel and or you have not subscribed to this channel yet, please click the subscribe button below and also click the bell icon so you'll be notified for future videos and giveaways. And today, yes, we are reviewing Soul by Costume National. Now this is a house out of Italy that's not very well known, but I, at least to me, they're not very well known in the fragrance community. And they do offer some great, great fragrances. One of the fragrances that I absolutely love from them is called Ohm, Costume National Ohm, this one. And this was uh, created by Dominic Ropion. And I'm a huge fan of it because it's very spicy, warm, and actually it represents the time of the year that's very celebratory, like uh, holidays, especially Thanksgiving and Christmas, where you're gathering with your family and having dinners and cooking and all that good stuff. But today's video is all about Soul, the fragrance that was launched in 2015. This is also a Dominic Ropion creation. This goes for $150 for 100 ml like this, and it comes in Eau de Parfum concentration. And this is also a unisex fragrance. Whereas this one is pour homme, so it was targeted to men, although I think it was pretty unisex uh, as it is. This one is a unisex targeted release, but to me this one actually leans a little bit more masculine. Let's go over the notes real quickly. So for top notes here in Seoul, we've got cardamom, pink pepper, and bergamot. In the heart notes, you've got geranium, leather accord, and oud wood. In the base notes, you've got gray amber, vanilla bean, and patchouli. So when they say gray amber, I'm assuming it's ambergris. Ambergris basically uh, translates to gray amber. So I'm assuming that's what they refer to, but uh, it wasn't very clear. Uh, I got the notes from Costume National's website. They have the uh, fragrances listed there and also the notes and even mention the perfumer, which is actually awesome because usually brands don't pay attention to the background of a perfume, whereas here with Costume National, they put uh, a lot of attention into the composition of this fragrance, which is uh, awesome for me, especially being a frag head. I love to find out all the details of fragrances, so, so I give Costume National high marks. So with Soul, it's a complete different fragrance than Ohm. Uh, again, Dominic Ropion, as I said, uh, did both of these, but this one actually is a blast. It's a big blast in your face as soon as it sprays on. It starts out with big spicy cardamom and pink pepper with lots of bergamot and then it gets deeper and deeper as the fragrance is um, developing. So in the heart notes you've got lots of leather, lots of oud and a little bit of spiciness from the geranium and what happens is it dries down to an amber vanillic amber, so the vanilla is pretty dominant for me here with patchouli. It's like a fragrance dream come true because it's drying down to be vanillic, patchouli, and amber. Those are three of my favorite, favorite notes. Um, and I love the way this dries down. And this actually makes it a perfect fragrance to wear in the fall and even better in the winter because it's, it's a big, bold fragrance. And I did mention that it's a bit on the masculine side, and I think it is, but confident women should actually be able to pull this one off. It's just, I think just the boldness, I think, just makes it a little on the more masculine side. It's, it's like a big punch in your face as soon as you spray it, and that's when you know this fragrance is gonna be a big, bold experience, and that's exactly what you get with it. So if you're not familiar with this house, uh, Costume National, and uh, notice that um, they spell the O in Costume National uh, lowercase, the rest of the letters in the, uh, the name or the logo are all uppercase, so do, do pay attention to that. I, I find that unique. Uh, but if you don't know this brand, do definitely check it out. I, I love four of their fragrances. This one, of course. Uh, of course, uh, then there's a Custom National Ohm, and then there's also Scent Intense, which is an amber, a floral amber, and then there's also Cyber Garden, which is this very, very 
avant-garde type of a green scent. So do explore the house and definitely check out Seoul because I think it's going to be perfect in the colder, cooler months that are around the corner for us. So if you want to participate, head over to sapphirebond.com. I'll have a link in the info box. Just click that link, go there, follow their directions, register and put a comment down and uh, wait for the results. And if you are a selected winner, do contact them immediately so that you can claim your prize. Also guys, what are your thoughts about Seoul by Costume National or in general, this house? Do you like this house? Have you tested out their fragrances? Do you wear any of their fragrances? Please do let me know so we can get a conversation started. Also, please like this video, please share it. Follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram, and I'll be back with more videos very soon. Have a good one, goodbye.